Hi and welcome to another Raspberry Pi tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to install the HomeKit app to pair your devices to your iOS 8 or above device. First you want to go to developer.apple.com https colon slash slash you want to make sure it's secure. Next you want to click on Member Center. Just log in with your Apple ID and once you're there, click on the SDK section and you here, welcome to the developer section of Apple. Next you want to click on Xcode and so you just want to scroll down a bit and this is where the key information is. Now everyone can get their app on their Apple device. So program membership not required. Previously you'd have to pay $99 to do this but now you don't. Now you want to you click on download and you want to download Xcode 7 beta. Once you click on that, it's a 5 gig file. I downloaded it already, so I'm going to cancel the download and open my downloads. And there it is, Xcode 7 beta.dmg. You want to open it and then you just want to drag in the app to the application shortcut and just give it a few seconds. In yeah, just give it a few seconds. If you can see in the corner, it says preparing to copy. So this takes some time depending on your hard drive and specs. So mine's just done and I'm going to open it now in the applications folder. Xcode a beta. There it is. Give it a few seconds. It might say verify. Mine did. There it is. Just skip past it, then click open. This might take a few seconds too. And there is Xcode. Just ignore that and make sure it's open and go to Safari and we're going to go to a new link. HTTPS colon slash slash developer.apple.com slash library slash iOS slash sample code slash home kit catalog. Make sure the H, the K, and the C are capital. I'll have all these links in the description. There it is. Just want to hit enter. And you need iOS 8.1 or above. Just click on download sample code. There it is. Now once you open it, welcome to Xcode. Now you want to go to the preferences after you go to the target section. And you can see, just go to preferences of Xcode. Command 1 if you would need to. Now log in with your Apple ID, go to the account section, hit the Apple ID button, and now you just want to log in. I've logged in, you can see I have the free versions of both. And now where it says build identifier, you want to add anything before the com. So I'm here adding here Umruth, and then add a dot after your random word. So I have umruth.com and then select your team, which is your Apple account, and then hit fix issue and it's gonna resolve the issue in a matter of seconds. Make sure your device is plugged in and hit build. Just give it a few seconds. You should see build succeeded. There we go, build succeeded. So now I'm gonna show you on my iPhone and here's my iPhone. You wanna select the home HM catalog app. Give it a few seconds. I've already had a few accessories paired. If the app works, great, you did this a good job. If it doesn't, you must have done something wrong. You can see, you can mess around with the app like I am. Good job if you did the app. In my next video, I'm going to be showing you how to pair your Raspberry Pi Node accessories with the app. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.